Mirena insertion and removal replacement. Preparation for insertion. Examine the patient to establish the size and position of the uterus and in order to detect any signs of acute genital infections or other contraindications for the insertion of Mirena and to exclude pregnancy. Insert a speculum, visualize the cervix and then cleanse the cervix and vagina with a suitable antiseptic solution. Grasp the anterior lip of the cervix with the tenaculum to stabilize the uterus. If the uterus is retroverted, it may be more appropriate to grasp the posterior lip of the cervix. Gentle traction on the forceps can be applied to straighten the cervical canal. The forceps should remain in position and gentle counter-traction on the cervix should be maintained throughout the insertion procedure. Advance uterine sound through the cervical canal to the fundus to measure the depth and confirm the direction of the uterine cavity. If difficulty is encountered, consider dilatation of the canal. Insertion. First, open the sterile package completely. Then use sterile technique and sterile gloves. Mirena is provided within an inserter consisting of the Mirena itself, already in the correct horizontal position, an anatomically curved insertion tube with a double-sided centimeter scale and a plunger inside, the flange, and the handle containing the mark, the slider, and the threads inside. Push the slider forward in the direction of the arrow to the furthest position to load Mirena into the insertion tube. Do not pull the slider downwards as this may prematurely release Mirena. Once released Mirena cannot be reloaded. Holding the slider in the furthest position, set the upper edge of the flange to correspond to the sound measurement of the uterine depth. While holding the slide in the furthest position, advance the inserter through the cervix until the flange is approximately 1.5 to 2 cm from the uterine cervix. Do not force the inserter. Dilate the cervical canal if necessary. While holding the inserter steady, pull the slider to the mark to open the horizontal arms of Mirena. Wait 5 to 10 seconds for the horizontal arms to open completely. Advance the inserter gently towards the fundus of the uterus until the flange touches the cervix. Mirena is now in the fundal position. Holding the inserter in place, release Mirena by pulling the slider all the way down. While holding the slider all the way down, gently remove the inserter by pulling it out. Cut the threads to leave about 2 to 3 cm visible outside of the cervix. Mirena insertion is now completed. Removal replacement. Mirena is removed by pulling on the threads with the forceps. You may insert a new Mirena immediately following removal. For full information, Consult the insertion instructions in the Mirena package.